All right, it's absolutely beautiful day. I came out to a beach that I've never been to before. And we're gonna give it a shot. Unbelievably, there's all kinds of people here. I'm really surprised of that fact, but we'll give it a go and see what's happening here. All right, showing a 5560 right here. <laughs> changing a little bit Looks like they got it like a sinker bent sinker it's a good sign piece of lead not too old Cover back up. We'll keep moving. Like I said, I'm sure the sound sucks when I'm facing the wind. The wind's really kicked up over here, but these guys are having a blast out there. Perfect conditions for that. as long as you can stay up out there. Oh, one went down. Probably the best way to turn around is by just dumping it and then getting all set back up in the water. See what he does. I'm sure you can control those things. I'm going to call the day here pretty soon. There's not much here. Other than a bunch of nice people. <clears throat> All right, I was headed back to the truck. And Looks like we've got a penny here. Definitely looks like it's copper. The green on it. We'll find out later. Pretty worn down. I think there was another target over here.
I might have found the coin spill jackpot over here. There's stuff all over the place. That sounds like a dime or a quarter. I thought I saw a penny, but there it is. something else around here yeah right here oh this one sounds like trash though get around the other way so helps with the wind got it out saw a coin. No, nope, shell. Another quarter. Eagle back. George. I think it says 1995. Fifty one cents out of that deal. All right, I kind of circled around here, and we're gonna hope that that's not foil. But it'd sure be nice if it wasn't. on it wherever it is got it sure sounds nice Picking up trash. That was it, I'll keep circling around here. Keep you guys on since I'm headed back to the truck. Just in case. like a bottle 
cow. For sure. But we'll get it off the beach. I think we got <clears throat> I turn around here. I think we got multiple targets. There's the bottle cap. And I think I see another coin. Corona. Another penny. Looks old. That was it. There you go. Dig everything. Fill this up and keep circling around because it seems like there's a little hot spot here. pretty deep and I think it's just a piece of iron but I decided to dig it anyway and hopefully oh look at that nothing but a screw I'm out pretty deep in fact I wouldn't be surprised if the sound sucks because I'm going to get smashed by the waves over here just like that. Throw that up there too. I'm going to have to get in a little bit closer. The tide's coming in. Tide's coming in. And I'm getting pushed around pretty good. So I want to see if this other piece is actually something. Yeah, it is. Definitely. Anyway. I don't know what that is. Piece of smashed lead with something on it or what it is, but... We'll bag it. I'm going to have to move in a little bit closer. Because of the water. I don't know what we got going on here. But this thing's screaming in my ears. Oh, it's just my favorite thing. Soul Crusher right on top. Pretty new one. Find something else here. Seems like there's multiple targets again. I got a good repeatable right there. 
Soul Crusher. big one it looked like it was off a tent or a awning thing for the beach sides on it all right I'll keep going I'm gonna keep digging everything on the way back to the truck it seems like it's some trash will help clean up the beach as usual. foil bottle cap made it sound even better than it was definitely multiple targets in one hole Alright, we'll keep going. Smart off. Came up as foil. This is why you should wear shoes on the beach. Piece of wire. That thing looks like it's brass. Bottle cap. Tint stake. It's like an old screw. So, you know, I'm paying 100, 200, 300 percent more on things that I was buying in 2019. Yep. You know, I realize that's not everything, but, you know, just essential stuff. I'm not talking frilly stuff, you know. 
we we made it, you know, down here it's like we make that, you know, you go through the sale ads, buy right. windows. Yep. And you go you, know, you go to Win Dixie for certain things, you go yep. to all these for something else. Yep. You go to Phoenix every once in a while. You know, yeah. And just and then we found a I think it's a discount place down in uh, Sarasota. Big grocery store. Right. They have all kinds of weird stuff in there. Right, right. Dirt cheap. You know, yeah. You know, you just kind of, kind of look at it and oh, yeah. you bought a, bought a freezer, put it in the garage. Yeah. You know, find a generator to keep the house and the, the grid yeah. going. Yeah. And that's, that's one of the things you just got to do because, you know, I think the generator's only kicked on like three or three times in three years. Right. But every Monday it starts up at 12 o'clock. Yeah. It does its test. Yeah. To five Make days, sure. It shuts itself off. Yeah. Hey, I don't know if you've ever hunted behind these guys uh, where they're raking the beach, but don't think that those things get everything. I tell you what, I've been right behind them, and you'd, you'd be amazed at what they kick up and those things don't catch. Huh. So, now, in fact, he don't even have it on. But, you know, they'll pick up the big stuff, you know, and I'm sure it'll, I'm sure it picks up chains and things like that. But I've found a whole lot of wow right behind those guys when they're working those things. And they know exactly what you're doing too, because I mean, literally up, you know, I'll stop them when they're coming back the other way. I'll see which way they're going just to stay out of their way, you know, just to be nice, but. All right, well, I'm going to get back to it. Nice meeting you. Nice meeting you. Yeah. Bobby. Bobby, Dan, good luck to you. And okay. we'll see what happens. All right. If you hear me say yee-haw, you know what happened. <laughs> okay, here we are at the wrap-up. Other than the lady's ring that we found for her, it was relatively uneventful. Got a couple pieces that... I'm really interested in but we'll start over here three tent stakes only one soul crusher that was close to the top bunch of bottle caps fishing weight some screws I think that one's brass I don't know wire bunch of stuff that would have poked people screwdriver end um, zipper pull I don't know what the heck that is, but that's made out of metal. Bunch of foil caps. I'm hoping this is lightning rock, but I don't know how to tell. Definitely got some shine in it, but who knows. Two quarters. Four pennies. One of them, I think, for sure. Maybe two or copper. A dime. That thing's definitely been down there for a while. I have no idea what the heck that thing is. Um, it has a name on it, and it looks like a zip code. And I'm wondering, you know, Bun is a coffee machine. But since it has that zip code on there, I'm wondering if it's like a key to some kind of lockbox or um, uh, what do you call it? post office box but I'll Google lens that here in a second I should have done it before this this thing I don't know if it's copper or not looks like it's not but it's got a little piece of bling on it I doubt that's silver in fact I know it's not because it's got a clip on it but anyway Met a bunch of nice people today, as you saw, and um, everybody wants to tell me their story, and it's always fun to talk to them and share stuff and whatever, but most importantly, you know, we found somebody's ring for him, and she was definitely frantic over the whole situation and made her day so if nothing else that's what counts 
and I got a ring, even though it was somebody else's. Ha ha. So anyway, I'll get back with you after I um, um, Google lens this, uh, if I can figure out what it is. So anyway, thanks for watching everybody, and make sure to like and subscribe, and more videos coming soon. Thanks. Okay, I just looked this up real quick. And it's a bun coffee maker spray head cleaning tool. All I gotta say is who the heck brings their bun coffee maker cleaning tool to the beach and leaves it for me. That's what I wanna know. Who are you and why would you do this? Ha, have a good one people.